this is cherry um donary in brackets i'm doing this video for the sake of um so many people asking me to do a video i thought there is too much videos on um youtube going on that people could learn but then everyone has been challenging me to do it i know i'm not going to be the perfect makeup on youtube or whatever but um since i have my customers my friends who have been buying my Mary Kay product because I'm a Mary Kay beauty consultant so I thought okay I should give it a go so today I'm really not gonna do a complex makeup because um, those of you who have been buying my product are just new to makeup I thought it fit to do this because I know most of you know me and you know I was not a makeup person I didn't do makeup but now I am into makeup and now selling makeup and having my own brand eyeshadows and brushes okay so I thought it fit to be honest or to just keep my customers I should do this video most of you are new um, who have been asking me to do this video so what I'm gonna do today is just um, an everyday makeup that you would use to go to work that you would use to go out to the beach and everything because I know most of you are in Africa and um, you love your life is getting to Christmas and you want to do that makeup that is so much on fleek so here we go I would be putting down everything I use in the description box because i don't want you to get distracted with whatever i'm doing because some of you out there has already bought some makeup from me so you have some of this stuff that i'll be using with you so i would explain under the description box what and what i use at the moment i've washed my face it's clean nice and moisturized I always try to moisturize my face before I do makeup for some reason I have a very dry skin around my face but in the middle of my nose hair it's very oily so I try to use um, the Mary Kay oil mattifier all of that I would take a picture and put it after this video so um, since you've been asking me to do this video I have been trying to find ways and simple skill of teaching you how to do your eyebrow which most of you are so much into so i'm gonna use this simple skill to see if that will work for you guys so here i go first of all i try to brush up my my eyebrow to make it looks neat and tidy and then use well if i was doing it to go out i would use my pencil but since I'm trying to teach you guys something and understand something, I would first of all go with my concealer. What I do when I go with my concealer is trying to just make a line with my eyebrow or under my eyebrow. So what I do is just this. You would have this brush. Those of you who've bought my brush, you will see this brush angle brush you use this angle brush to do your con your concealer so I think this is a simple step because I've used the step to teach two people and it has worked for them so I'm thinking it will work for you so I use my concealer put it at the back of my hand and then conceal under my own So I don't know if you guys could see what I've done. I've just used the concealer instead of the pencil to conceal my own eyebrow. And um, I 
I hope this works for you guys. So. So you could actually see without the pencil, I've actually done my eyebrow without a pencil. So here you go. I think I would only do one face. So there you go. Here is the concealer. So if you like because for me i would leave it like that if i want to it depends on where you're going so then now because you've done this it's so easy to just use the pencil and fill it in that is it so I try to do it properly now like this I hope this works out properly for you guys yeah so this is what I've done okay let me do the other eye Those of you who go and um, some people do how do you call it? take off your eyebrows I don't think you need to the only thing you need to do is shape your eyebrow because in fact no two eyebrows are the same no two things are the same anyway so thin it here Again, I've just done this, guys, and then I'll use a pencil and just fill it in. I don't know if this is any good. If this has actually taught you or teach you something. Yes, I've actually hardly used any other products when it comes to concealers and um, foundation because. I'm a Mary Kay beauty consultant and I've been using Mary Kay for the past over a year and try not to mix my foundation because um, sometimes as we all know these things are all chemical so the moment you start using different kind of foundations on your face you may not know which one would react or why your face is as bad as something I'm not having the best face or something but then you could see how my face looks like sometimes i don't know these days my face reacts as if i'm still a teenager i hope you understand what i mean when it's time to what's my period i start getting bumps and all of that stuff and get me so not so yeah this is it guys see look at it i've not done anything other than concealing and putting the filling it with a pencil um, now what I will do is try to use because I'm in brown and I'm trying to do an everyday makeup look I use my Doneri set I use my Doneri set eyeshadow and then 
I brush my first ever makeup video guys so I hope I do justice to this the difference and I use the Mary Kay my skin tone is six with Mary Kay so I use the Mary Kay foundation this is just an everyday look guys so my foundation brush that's my foundation for the back of the back of my hands and then try to what I do first is try to cover this place so it looks the same just a little bit of it You would have seen so many different types of um, videos around, but everybody does the look they like for themselves. So when I do a natural look, this is what I actually like to see. I don't like to see too much of my concealer. With Mary Kay, I don't actually conceal my No, I don't have too much dark spots so I don't conceal dark spots because Mary Kay is as perfect as Need a little bit more, it's finished.
guys this is my face done this is just a simple everyday look this is just a natural simple everyday look I don't know if you could tell the difference and how simple my eyebrow looks this is my face let me bring it close to you this is my eyebrow What would you say about the Mary Kay foundation I just use? It looks as natural as my skin, blending very well, and that's it. And because it's my everyday kind of look, and I'm gonna be home, what I do is just do a lip gloss. It's kind of pinky. I just want to look gloss. Actually. And I give myself a little blush. Those of you who think you would want to just step out for a little bit. see the blush yeah I don't do too much makeup to be honest because it's not worth it too much makeup doesn't make any sense for me I like it keep it simple I like colors sometimes when I'm going out it depends but like I told you today, I'm just doing this simple look that you could even go out with. The only thing you can do, maybe add um, a different color to your, your eyebrow colors or something. But this is just a simple look. And maybe you want a little... Shiny shimmer, a glowy cheek. Yeah. So when you smile, so now I'm gonna just put my hair down, give it a brush. And guys, tell me what you think about my If you're happy with this guys give it a thumbs up make any comment below this video ask a question and then we'll take it from there my next video is gonna be a very glamorous look which will be using different colors I will be doing highlighting and contouring and yes so guys this is me I'm so happy that I've finally done this video finally finally done this video I 
eyebrow that is cherry berry <sighs> oh my god yeah donary we are donary we're ready to give out whatever you guys ask of us if we can do thank you for watching give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed and we take it out from there thanks to all those of you who have been buying my products helping me to be a successful woman in life God would make you successful in whatever thing or whatever business or whatever work you put your hands to do before i go i would show you my cleanser that i use this is a three in one mary Kay cleanser i use this every two days to wash my face um this is it it's three in one you don't have a night one or a day one or something you could use this every day or every other day and then you have the day solution this is what actually moisturize your face after having bath you have to apply it on your face and then before you do your makeup it's good for your face to have that moist before you put your makeup on on top of it because some of you have very dry skin you also have the night solution which is just here this is the night solution i'll actually put everything underneath the description box it comes like in a bag like this so thank you guys for watching Don't worry, B and W.